Hey, what's going on guys? Log.zip here. Hey, check it out, there's a cow behind me. Anyways, we wanted to show you, the cow and I, <laughs> we wanted to show you an awesome MC Edit filter today. Now check out this world behind me. Looks pretty normal, right? Everything looks pretty, you know, normal. Nothing's out of order. Well, you know what would be something real interesting? Let's make things a little bit odd by removing everything even. It's just Jumby has made an awesome MC edit filter that will remove all the even X, Y, and Z blocks in your Minecraft world to make for some ridiculous looking landscapes. Look at this as we zoom out. We've got this crazy graphical, I mean look at it, it's wild. Oh my goodness. Now this is going to be something you can use the program MC Edit Filter to run to transform any of your worlds or any of your MC Edit schematics, really anything you want that you can put in MC Edit anyways, into a decombobulated mess. I don't really know what's going on here, but it looks really interesting to say the least. You can peek down in the caves and such. And the best part about it is, like I said, you can use any world save you want. You could use it with some awesome structures you find on Planet Minecraft. You could use it on anything you've built. You can do a lot with it. It's not really good for anything. It's just a fun little mess to look at. So I'm going to show you how you do it right now. But hey, if you think this is cool, you should leave a like. All right, thanks. So, my friends, here we are in a beautiful world, and what you might notice is it's also still normal. I want to show you what this world looks like before we run this awesome filter on it to just blow a series of holes all over the place until this thing is completely unrecognizable. So, so take it all and take a good whiff of it. Bunch of pigs all over the place. We got some great squids hanging out. Now, all this stuff you're seeing extra, don't mind it. It's just a mod, you know, with the makes the trees look real nice and, and this and that. What the point is, is it's all a normal piece of land for now. Let's start right on this beach. We're gonna position ourselves on an odd block. That way when we run the filter, we don't find ourselves, you know, like dying and, and, and such, you know? So let's go ahead and start right there. There, so we're gonna start right on this block. And now we're gonna say, Goodbye, so, goodbye. So, we've loaded the world in question into MC Edit. I'm gonna click record undo because I'm not gonna make any mistakes. That's gonna make everything run faster. If you're just trying to remove blocks as you saw in the video a second ago, then you can do that as well. It's gonna make everything run a little bit faster. Not gonna teach you how to use MC Edit, I'm sorry. You're gonna have to figure it out on your own. There's plenty of YouTube tutorials, but everything you need to know about MC Edit is simple enough. Uh, I'm gonna teach you what you need to know to remove the blocks here. So we've got MC Edit open. Fine, we've got the world in question that we're going to be editing open, and we are in chunk view. Go ahead, just press Control plus A. That's gonna select all the blocks in this world, yeah. Then click filter. Then download in the description of this video the block deleter filter. And put it in your filters folder again. If you don't know how to do that, too bad. Just look it up, man. It's not that hard. I look it up too. And you click block deleter. Now there is a solid chance that when you do this. It's gonna make your computer slow down, possibly even crash. So, you select a block deleter, you press filter, and you wait. Here we go. Oh man, oh man. And it looks like, it, it looks like my MC edit just froze. And it definitely just froze. And just like that, after a little bit of time, depending on how fast or slow your computer is, you will see that you have a lovely rendered out chunk. Let, let's get a good look at this, huh? I'm gonna just drop on down here. Mm-hmm. Check it out. This is sick. And now we're gonna check out how it looks in game. And we're back. But the blocks have uh, mostly stayed the same. Well, that's okay. Or have they? <laughs> well, the transformative process took a little bit longer than I was expecting to, but as you can see, we have done it. Check it out. Do you remember what it looked like just a second ago? If you don't, go just you know rewind like you know, 20 seconds or whatever. This is the world we were just in. Destructed. Destructed? Sure. Yeah, we go destructed. That's nice. This is what happens when you run that block deleter filter. It will take all blocks in positive, or excuse me, not positive, excuse me, even coordinates on X, Y, and Z. See, notice we're currently standing on odd. We're currently looking at 187, 69, 167, just like that. But nothing on the even spectrums at all. It just is a straight drop into nothingness. But this allows us to have a fun look inside of the caves. Look at this, like within a very close radius, we've got redstone, we've got 
Oh yeah, it's called gold. Iron, redstone, coal, any diamonds, any emeralds for us? I bet you there's some. Well, actually, we're not low enough, technically. But dum dum dum. All right, let me see. Maybe there's some diamonds over here. Let's try to find some diamonds. Actually, the best way to do this is gonna be game of three. We just sift on through them all. But as you can see, it's a really fun thing you can just do to your worlds. And uh, ooh, bit of lag there. Now, be careful around water. Water, as you can see, can cause a lot of lag. Whoa. Hey, look at this. This looks crazy. Do you see this right now? The way it's almost like optical illusion status. Wow. Now, oh, we get rid of the F3. Everyone hates when I keep F3 on. Whatever. It's useful information, man. Oh, and I'm going to put on. Check it out. Man. So if you decide to do any of this new world, uh, make sure you uh, don't use. You, use a backup world. You know what I mean? Otherwise, you pretty much destroyed your entire world. Wow. Look at this. It's like beautiful. I'm almost reminded of like, oh, I don't even want to say the movie. Yeah, it's not spoilers. It's not spoilers. Um, no, this won't mean anything. It's my I, I Think of gravity. Anyone seen gravity? I'm reminded. I mean, let's let's throw, slow it down even further. I'm gravity. I'm here to make you trip and fall and hurt your ankle. <laughs> I'm evil. And of course, if you get a nice bird's eye view, you can see fun little patterns that pop up, almost like a crosshair. It follows wherever you're standing. It's like, I got you. You over here now? Oh, well, I'm over here too. Even if you speed up real fast, like, you know, it's just going to trace you wherever you go. But my friends, that is going to do it for this video. It's just Jumby has brought to you an awesome block deleting filter. Amazing stuff. You got to check it out if you use MC Edit or even if you don't, it's all it takes is really just a simple download. Then you run the filter on your world and you can make for some really cool geometric looking illusion slash world changes or you could just make a copy of one of your friends worlds oh worst guy do this watch seriously you should do this make a copy of one of your friends worlds run this filter on it hide the real world somewhere and then just replace this oh my gosh watch them cry would be hilarious hey if you do make them cry you should leave a like on this video and subscribe if you're not already so you can find out more awesome it's just a prank bros all right see you later